burn copies of the Quran on the anniversary of the September 11th terror attacks, despite international condemnation. The senior U.S. commander in Afghanistan has warned that troops, li troops' lives could be in danger if the Dove World Outreach Center in Florida goes ahead with the plan. <laughs> The Dove World Outreach Center was an obscure, half-empty local church until Pastor Terry Jones announced his plans for Saturday. He intends to torch copies of the Quran here on the anniversary of the 9-11 attacks. The pastor said it's a message of defiance to radical Islam, but he's been universally criticized. I am heartened by the clear, unequivocal condemnation of this disrespectful, disgraceful act that has come from American religious leaders of all faiths, from evangelical Christians to Jewish rabbis, as well as secular U.S. leaders and opinion makers. The planned event has already proved incendiary in Afghanistan, where protesters have burned effigies of Pastor Jones and from where NATO's commanding general has warned of retaliatory attacks on American troops. But with some 200 Qurans at the ready, the pastor insists his bonfire will go ahead. If we don't do it, uh, when, when do we stop backing down? Uh, when, when do we stop giving in to Islam or radical Islam? You are when, stupid when, when they burn the flag, when they kill Christians, when they burn churches. A religious row was already simmering over plans to build a mosque and community center just a short distance from ground zero. And unless Pastor Jones relents, this year's September the 11th could become a public relations disaster. Steve Kingston, BBC News, Washington.